Well, hello everybody. This is Dave Burkus for the Burkus Report on Business. And today's subject begins a series on positioning your company with our very first positioning statement. And that is, which is better, faster or better, speaking of your product or your service? You know, there are many ways to position a company within a market in order to achieve maximum market share or maximum revenues or maximum profits. In this series, we'll examine a number of insights directed at positioning your company, your product or your service to fill the gaps in larger competitors' landscape and take advantage of the agility of your smaller enterprise. So here it comes. Which is better, faster or better? You know, sometimes doing it well or doing both well wins the day. Well, this is one of those arguable insights where both sides win, of course. Dell is a great example of emphasis upon fast, creating a customized computer in 48 hours or less, bringing in assemblies and components just in time to make the assembly line. However, if Dell had poor quality and their returns were high, well, the company surely wouldn't have survived on speed and response alone. So if someone were to ask, what's the secret sauce, Michael Dell? Dell's response would be something like, quality custom computers more quickly than the competition. That's a mantra, and it works. And this company, in this example, both quality and speed are the critical factors in competitive advantage. Well, we can give you more examples. Think of McDonald's. Its reputation is based upon fast food in a minute, with quality that is acceptable but not discernibly above the competition. Or one of the instant auto service companies where an oil change is fast and inexpensive, but the number of inspection points far fewer than at a dealer location. Speed above quality. We have become a society not used to paying even for a little extra for speed, but we're willing to pay much more for quality. How about the $14 hamburger at a restaurant compared to fast food? We pay for the quality of the product and the service and the experience, happily defining our own tolerance for cost versus quality and speed. So here's an important decision for you. In planning for your niche to defend, one of the first decisions is between quality and speed. Sometime soon in the series, we'll examine the entire gamut of pricing structures for future weeks or future times, but let's start with just this one. It is fair to repeat that quality and speed together are the winners in this contest, not just one alone. So here's questions for your management team. Which will you want to accent for your competitive advantage? How will your customers react to your positioning? Will you make more in revenues and profits with one against the other? Where are your competitive landscapes? And is there a more aggressive competitor with one speed or quality as opposed to the other? Can you knock off the competition in one of these areas more easily than the other? These are all great questions for your next strategic planning session or board meeting. Try them. Well, this is just one of 300 or more examples in Birkonomics, my books which are available on Amazon, and I'd be happy to have you pick one of them up, or all three of them if you can, and read some of these insights. And I'm happy to be able to see you next time when we speak of Birkonomics and the Birkus Report. See you then.